You do it out of the love, right? For the love of the game, bro. For the love of the game. Just just a couple of 30 plus year olds hanging out in a driveway. This just makes us feel better about us doing nothing with our day. Yep. Pretty much doing nothing other than sitting in a driveway, putting a spoiler on a badass ride. I be flossing. I be flossing. I be flossing. I be flossing. Big boy pants, big boy pants going on right now. All right, guys, so today we are going to um, install a Hellcat spoiler on a three-piece RT. Uh, it's my buddy, Sean, Red Hemi RT. His Instagram is gonna be, his Instagram is gonna be in the description. Uh, I am probably gonna be watching along and assisting in any fashion that I can. Uh, I have no clue how, how this is supposed to go. But for all of you guys that are interested in doing this swap, this video should help. Uh, I will be documenting each step along the way. Um, and for those that do not wish to do that, I have chosen to go with a wicker bill on the three piece spoiler. I know a lot of people are not huge fans of that, but um, yeah, let's, let's get it going. So we're gonna need fishing wire. Just uh, get it off, you know, get under the wing, get this 3M tape on there. You gotta get that off, so without scratching it. Okay, so fishing, fishing wire. wire. I would do the silicone, okay. tight silicone. I did for the plugs, which I Obviously the Google. painted. So I'm gonna silicone underneath them and silicone under there, so okay. no water will Those come are the in. plugs. Painted them up. Okay. I got some 3M tape to lay on there, around there. I'm okay. I'll give that to you. I got that. Um, this is just some bug and tar remover to, at the finished product, because supposedly. And then your Goo Gone. Yeah, Goo Gone is what's gonna loosen this up, supposedly. Okay. And then uh, it, the, the biggest project of this is actually cleaning this off now. Okay. You know what I mean? Because this is all exposed, kind of. So you're gonna, there's going to be the M3 tape, uh, 3M tape under there, uh -huh. which you're going to want to buff out or do whatever you got to do. So I'm going to have to get a wheel to this when we get this off. And that's the biggest part of this, basically, I'm here. All right. He's attacking on the stage we're about to, ripping this thing off. And then cleaning it up with the little shit that um, you're supposed to start fucking with, you know? So you um, need to start unbolting. I was told you unbolt these, the hinges. You got to take these lights out. We're going to remove these little black plugs to get to this side. So you get your hand in there. There's stuff we got to cut under here. Okay. We have to drop this whole piece down. So this is all got to come out. These plugs got to come out. It should just drop down. There's going to be four... If everything's lined up, hopefully it is. There should be two bolts here. And then there's gonna be another one right here. We gotta take this black piece off. And that's all the bolts for that. My Dude, biggest thing. The, the freaking wrap that you, that you did. Yeah, what the fuck? That was savage. Bro, did that's you see terrible. I gotta rewrap my hood too now. Really? I caught a rock, bro. I mean, it's not crazy, but that's gonna drive Oh, me I see nuts. it. Yeah, that's. Sucks. So I gotta rewrap that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would like to get the scat hood. I can't find it. Well, you just go up to the dealer. Yeah, just go up to the deal Dodge dealer. Price, oh, you know how much deal price is? Fuck that. Someone just, just told just me it costs head. like 450 bucks. Yeah, but you can get them way cheaper, I think. And no, not if it's 500 if bucks or something deal, like that. Really? If I heard a deal is going to be like 800. Mm. And then even if I did the, I don't know if you've seen, I did the rear balancer to get in the circle. I just got to get the tips. Oh, yeah. The piece, is good. Like, the piece is $68. Okay. But they charge you a core price of $100, guaranteed. So if you ever order something out of the dealership, they're going to charge you this core price, it's called. They want you so to how much was it, how much did it cost altogether? So right there, when I first bought it, it was $168 for the okay. core price. But now, I had to give them back my old one. And then and you got $100, $100 back. back. Okay. Which right. I don't understand why they do that, but I heard anytime you buy a part from the dealer, 
they're gonna hit you with this core charge. Really? Even if I went to go buy it online, because I even found it online for 60 bucks, but when you go to do the checkout, you know, check the, the car. I mean, out. as long as you got your hundred bucks back, who cares? Yeah, then? yeah. Because what are you gonna do with the other balance, right? Well, that's who gives what a I'm crap? Saying. Yeah. I, I leased mine, so I was more or less like, all right, well, let me try and keep everything just in case they gave me some shit. You know? I don't think they're gonna even notice that you swapped out the the rear balance. I don't balance. think they'll do that. That's not a big one. This one they might. With the, you know. You think they would give a crap? I, I, I mean. Yeah. I never know. Especially, I heard uh, I got I went through teachers. I was approved through. Okay. So from what I understand, they have actually somebody else come in, um, Fusion, because uh, teachers does their own thing. But Fusion is like this actual car. They want their cars back when you lease it because they sell them. You know what uh -huh. I mean? So they're not only are they like a finance company, but they also sell cars. Like they're known for this. Okay. So I because I went to the dealer just the other day. To see if I could get into a scat, you know, they sent me something, uh, one hundred twenty dollars over trade-in value of your car. So if that's the case, I could have got into a scat, but that was all bullshit just to get me down there. Hmm. So um, yeah. So I don't know exact, but but then in the same, like I was saying to you, like I mean, in the scat pack, it's just like anybody could do it. If I had the money to come out of pocket. I would just have, you know, I would just fix this thing. That As we go, learning as we go. That's it. That sounds like it broke. Might have. Looks pretty good though. All right. Oof. Didn't sound good though. Yeah, it stayed in place. This one stayed in. I just gotta hook it in. All right. It did all right. Everyone usually breaks that shit. Hopefully I didn't. So, uh, note to the people watching. These are tough. Take your time with these ones. Nice. Dude, this is winter. This is sick. Sweet, bro. See, that, that came off nice. Yeah, that, well, that you know came what it was? This, nice. this one just, you, don't pull this one out. Uh huh. This one, see, it slide. You actually have to slide this one up and push this one in. So this one, you just keep in there. Don't try to pry it. Okay. That's a good note because everyone's been ripping them right off. You hear that, ladies and gentlemen, mostly gentlemen. Ninety-eight percent of the people that watch my videos are are guys. So, so. I am not crushing it with the ladies at all. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. So. There's a bolt there. Now when we take these off, there's that bolt we need. That's gonna be one of the bolts that's gonna line up. So that's okay. gonna come out. Same on the other side. Here are the other two. Yup. So my wing looks like it will line up very nice. If everything is done. One, two, that should be it. And, and how much did you get this for? Uh, $98, Spoiler Kings off of Amazon. $98. Ship Spoiler Kings. I'll be like every other YouTuber. Shout out! <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta start waking up in the morning yelling at the phone. Bro, I know. Else What's up? YouTube? <laughs> I, 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 I have my thing. It's Alright, guys. Alright. All right. This, this is where we're gonna have some time because you gotta let this shit sit. Okay. So what shit are you doing? What are, I'm what are using we... the Goo Gone. Goo gone? Okay. So when we goo gone. All 
Are you going to tint your windows or what? No? I don't know, man. I'm trying to avoid any type of situations with the police. Okay. I got pulled over. I just hit a, got a seatbelt ticket. Did you really? You got a seatbelt ticket. See, the if you had tinted windows, you could... I hear you. But they would have got me for the, probably the tint. Yeah, first I know, but... How, what? First of the month. As soon as the new year came, the day after New Year's, I, I got a ticket. Son of a... Cop tells me... I really don't write like writing tickets. I said, then why be a cop? <laughs> so you don't. I, don't, I really don't. I, like I don't like tickets. writing tickets, but here you go. Yeah. I was like, sitting, you know what? Buckle up, dude. Yeah, what are you no. doing? Yo, hundred and seventy dollars in New York for a seatbelt ticket. Wow. The ticket itself, twenty-seven dollars. So if I would have just paid, had to pay a ticket, it would only have been twenty-seven dollars. Okay. Hundred and seventy dollars at the end of the day. Surcharge is eighty-eight dollars for no reason, and then another surcharge for fifty. $5 no oh, reason. they crush you with the... Did you plead guilty? I pled the guilty. Okay. I don't want to deal with them. So when I pled guilty, they send me a thing anyway for I have to show up in court. I deny everything. Deny, deny, deny. What do you mean? You go to fight them? I, yeah. I, I, I have nothing else to do. Yeah, now. Now that... Well, now I... But I always... I would take a day off from work and just... Yeah. And just fight it. Yeah. Someone gave me that advice a long time ago. You know and, what? Uh, I'm, I just want to be out of I don't want nothing to do with police. I have bad luck. I'd rather you have just bad luck. stay away from <laughs> That's why, you know, I mean, here we go. The only reason I want to get a scat is to do the shit like Frank does. Act like a silly guy. <laughs> tape if we can. Seems pretty tough though. And lightly rock it. Oh yeah. It's 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 happening. This is it. It's a little tough though. This is it man! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! There's no no we, I think we're good if we take this piece off and fuck up. Oh, there There's is no a, turning there is back a now. There is a, I think I'm on that bolt. So we have a bolt here and or here and where? Pretty much here. Yeah. Like right around here and right around there. Okay. I think I'm on it. Unless it's that tight. Yeah, we're on that bolt. Yup. You are on that bolt. Dang it. Damn bolts. But we are Ooh. up. And we might not need. Say goodbye. Hopefully it works. It's nice and tight, isn't it? Yeah. That's what you have. I don't want to bust no paint, <laughs> no paint buster. Woo! That 3M tape works. Well, we definitely made it where it's not coming out. Yeah, it's just no fucking 3M tape. There it is. The point of no return, right here. How shall we do that? These are the hardest ones they say, these side pieces. Of course I'm not. I just don't have the patience to do this myself, to be honest with you. I kind of like doing the work myself rather than someone else do it. Okay. Because they don't give a fuck about my car at the end of the day. True. But you are an entrepreneur. Don't you care about your business? What do you mean? Like, you care about your reputation. So when they work on your car, it's a repu... You know. Yeah, you say that, look at... Savage Auto Sports, look how they care about their shit. I never <laughs> wrap my shit. One of the reasons why I'm getting rid of it.
Man, this little sucker is hard, huh? It is a bit too long. I'm running out. Gotta kind of get it in there. There's four or three. They're all the way up here. You oh, gotta hold right. this wing in. I don't know if you can get them. No, it's too dark, but okay. okay. So you gotta either cut them, or you can try and figure out how to get them out. I'm told the cutting part is the easiest. But we never did this shit, so we don't know. That's good though. <coughs> so if I just bust them, they should come up. Or just even. Gotta bust that somehow. How can I do that? These fucking things are flying. <laughs> that bitch a snap. That one got me on my lip. This is such a tedious process. Oh yeah, this is the part that sucks. This is what I was saying, the, the cleaning part. You're gonna have to plug these up. Just these. But when the Hellcat spoiler goes down, it's gonna cover these holes anyway. But this is what you're left with. All right, we just have to clean everything up and then the spoiler's going on. I'm cutting it here. I don't want to cramp your style, you know? You're doing really good right now. Except for Savage. What? You still going with Savage? <laughs> He's the only person I could blame right now, bro. <laughs> I think you're doing great, though. You're certainly doing better than the company that you continue Boy. pooping on. And I don't even get paid to do this shit. Do it out of the love, right? Bro, for the love of the game, bro. For the love of the game. Just just a couple of 30 plus year olds hanging out in a driveway. This just makes us feel better about us doing nothing with our day. Yep. Pretty much doing nothing other than sitting in a driveway, putting a spoiler on a badass ride. Was bad until Savage got the hands on. Oh my god. Poor guy. Savage is going down, bro. Going downtown. We are going down for this shit. And now, I don't have enough, so I'm gonna use this one over there. I'm gonna start with a little. 
perfecto. You want to do it in perfecto? Perfecto. Big boy pants. Big boy pants going on right now. This All is right. it. Let's see. Don't get scared now. Wait, you don't have your screw in? I have my screw in. I'm going to pass you your corner. Got it? Cool. That's all right. So I'm right there is where I need to be. How are you? I'm there. All right, okay. so just start screwing in, I guess. Big boy pants. Yeah, now hopefully the middle one's going to line up. <laughs> I hope so. It's on. We've committed. We've committed. Oh wait, I messed up. Right. I I'm just kidding. I got scratches. Man, you know, just just trying to live the dream. I would not be able to do it without you, my friend. All right. Just putting the finishing touches on this bad boy. So the shakiness of the hand right there, I didn't want to over tighten it. Yeah. I might have to even just do the screws in this one, bro, because these ain't snugging up too good. These are snugging up good. I don't think that little ass screw will fucking do it. You think it'll hold it? You know how many times you say something and I, I, I immediately think that's what she said? I don't think that little ass screw is <laughs> gonna do it. <laughs> Come on. The moment of truth, man. Get it in the hole. Just tap it in. Just tap, tap, tap. That's what I'm talking about. Tap, tap, tap. All right. So he's going to do each of those holes. And that looks pretty, pretty close to the paint color, man. I mean, it's the paint color. Spot on. Got it out the Dale ship. Good. Cool. 